Now, hello, you wonderful bunch. No respawns here. Hope you're doing well. So, this is my cafeteria type room. This is one of the, well, few rooms in the castle. So, we've got, I've done the armory. I've done the captain's quarters. This is the cafeteria, cafeteria, cafeteria area. There's also a barracks, but I'm not really going to put that into a video. It will be in the tour, obviously. It's just because it's not really very interesting. So, you know, this one's quite short because it's quite a quick build, really. It's it's all right. It's, it's a pretty solid kitchen. I'll be honest. I and I'm going to ask. This is one of those few instances where I genuinely do want some tips on how you feel it should look because I was a little bit as a lost to decorate this. I kind of got it and I was like, oh yeah, this will look really cool. And it looks decent, but it's way too open. Like when you get to the tour, it's way too open. But keeping with the style, I might have to, I don't know, maybe I just might, I'm probably end up leaving it as is, but if you've got any suggestions once you see the tour of just kind of like bits I can add in that kind of fit the theme, let me know, because it just seems a little bit like it's missing more than something. It's missing quite a lot. Also, so this is the penultimate castle vid. So the next castle video will be the completed tour because all I've got to do now is just a couple of filler shacks on the inside of the castle like you know the main courtyard area and decorate the corridors and do the two or three other guns on the top and that's that's everything literally the entire thing's done after that and the wee barracks area so that's it castles castles nearly done that's a little bit a little bit weird, don't you think, after about several months? Those likely very few of you who have just happened to stumble across this vid without watching most of the others will not realise this, but we've basically been building this castle for about, yeah, two months. I've done about 30 videos, I think, on it. Or like 20 to 30. I've done quite a lot just on the castle. And it's been quite a journey. It's, it's, I, it's one of those ones, I was talking on Twitter the other day, that it, I was expecting to only do about five videos and it's just like oh we can just do it like that we can do it this and I like how my ori original plan was it to look like um was it Megaton yeah Megaton we were gonna go for a literal Megaton vibe in actual fact it looks more like Diamond City to me or it's kind of like it feels it feels like it's its own unique settlement that's been inspired by Diamond City which I am really really pleased with how it's turned out also you know it's the frame rate's not too bad um we have had a few issues especially in the last video, um, someone pointed out it might have been due to, one, the scrapping mods, where I have to scrap all the rubble, because quite a few bits of rubble in there that kind of messes, makes it a bit jittery, and also the fact of the Aslam's Junk mod, might also, um, Workshop Pack might also be it, because we did overuse that. We use it a little bit in here, but not as much as I used it in the General's Quarters. Anyway, but yes, Penultimate Castle vid. Aww. Aww. Actually, I'm quite excited. I, I, I basically, as I've mentioned before, I haven't actually played played the game because obviously, because I wanted, I want to, and I, I can't promise I'm going to try and do. I'm going to record me. Spoiler. Well, basically, the castle can get attacked during the main game, depending and by various people, I think as well. And I'm going to record me defending it, right? However, because I'm at this is my second playthrough. This this save, by the way, I haven't finished the game on it, and. I want to do, like, the invasion, the uh, the attack, so I can't do any more questing, because, I mean, there might be a few side quests and places to explore, but there's not really much for me to do right now, and I haven't actually play played the game in ages, and I'm getting really antsy. I've almost started a couple of new games recently, I'm like, no, 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 because then it will distract you, and you know, I can't do that. <laughs> so it's cool, because I'm, I'm actually really keen to, I do end up putting that baseball bat in the, uh, is that what the thing back there? It's a baseball bat in a umbrella stand. Looks really cool, and I do end up using that. But yes, I'm really keen. The next settlements, I'm going to do all of them. Everyone keeps asking, when are you going to do X? I will do X settlement when I get round to it. Okay? Cool. Just saying. Everyone always asks that. <laughs> um, but I'm going to do everything. I really want to do things like Bunker Hill, for example, because I've physically never seen any Bunker Hill videos ever. Um... And you unlock that in the main quest, which is quite be quite a cool one to do. Spectacle Island, you know, all of them, all of them, everyone, you know, um, the Mechanist Layer, for example, things like that. I've got loads. Go back to Vault 81. Now we've got mods. Um, <clears throat> someone asked me this on Twitter actually earlier today. In fact, to so point out, I am actually going to be going back to Vault 81 and because we don't have the lighting options. If you remember, I stopped building there because the lighting was shit. I'm going to kind of revive my. Let's make it look like Metro 
kind of style, so that the Metro 2028, whatever it's called, uh, the game that looks really cool that's been announced on Steam as well. Um, on Steam on E3 recently. It looks really grand. But this was pre-mod, so now we have mods. I can do like a quite kind of scrappy dark dingy one which is just ju junk and shit everywhere well it should do i don't know when i'm gonna do that i'm not definitely not doing that next because i fucking hate the vault <laughs> but i will do it it would probably be mostly decoration i'm not too sure anywho but yes i'll probably do a mod review after this before we do the tour because I've got, I've got quite a lot to kind of scutter work to build basically and I'm, I'm not gonna have it done for you know a good few days it'll be over the weekend basically that the castle tour will be will be then so yes, like this this whole decoration, I like the way it looks, right? It looks cool, it looks like a kitchen, it's pretty grand, but I feel it's missing something. <laughs> and that's not really me selling it very well, um, but I spent a good part of an hour and a half just kind of doddering. Oh no, I think it was about two hours actually, because I think I finished building, what was it? So for me it's half eleven, yeah, I finished building about half nine, because I got back from work, you know. And I've spent the last two hours just doddering in this place, being like, it's it's something missing. Like, moving moving stuff on shelves. This is me trying to find the bench, by the way. I, I wanted to keep my finding in because I wanted to show you where it is. I've forgotten where it is. Oh, I put those in first. Then I find the bench. But yeah, like, I spent about two hours just doddering in the decoration. Like, this is post-recording. Like, just kind of post me recording these bits, being like... Mm. And there's not even very much decoration as well. I've, I've kept the junk decoration low. One, because I didn't know what to do. But also because, um... I don't want to make the frame rate drop too much. <laughs> I think it's because it doesn't... I was expecting... I think because I wanted these two... Ta two of these tables in, right? Problem is, it's way too cramped if you have two. But if you have one, it's way too empty. It's really annoying. We need, like, a long... I should have glitched two tables together. Fuck, that's what I should have done. God damn it! That would be a brilliant idea. Well done, David. Thank you. I'll do that. Before the next tour. <laughs> Glitch two tables together. Um, but yeah. Yeah. It's it's going to be cool. I'm quite excited to finish the castle. I am really excited to finish the fucking castle actually. I want to build other things. Other things. I love. I love. I'm in such a kind of like. I've mentioned this before. This is such a relaxing constant for me. This game. Just like. Some people are like. You should stop doing full art content. It's boring right now. It's like. Well yes actually. I do want to do other content. But no game has struck me. As something I want to continue doing. Um, to be utterly frank. Nothing has engaged me. In the same way this has. Um, but people still watch. Oh yeah. I did change the signage around. But it took me ages. To, that's from uh, the custom Villain or Assets mod. But yeah. No. I, I spent ages. Just kind of fucking with the. Um, what was I saying? I, I that, 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 that switch just completely. Threw me off there but yes i quite like playing fallout and i like decorating it's become my relaxing constant that i do it's like it's such a perpetual thing for me now it's like a kind of oh just build some shit it's pretty cool and i think i've, I've with the castle i've kind of like i uh, yeah this took ages to get this fucking thing this fucking three we've gone the fucking wrong it's really annoying you gotta see it hop hop see it hop there a little bit you gotta do that but yeah no i i, I really am antsy to start building other shit now Fucking oh, and my I was gonna I might do a an E3 video by the way. Um, I may or may not. But basically, what games am I excited for? Well, we're quickly doing this. I am not excited for anything from either Thursday. They had a shit conference, as you all know. Um, except Wolfenstein is that Bethesda? But the games I'm excited for anyway are uh, Beyond Good and Evil 2. Um, what do we call it? Oh, well, before we get to the tour, Beyond Good and Evil 2. Um, Life is Strange, the prequel. Um, Griftlands by Clay Entertainment, best dev ever. And also, what's the other one? Oh, and the new Metro game. Boom, and the tour's starting now. Yes! Haha. <laughs> so there we go. I'm, I'm a bit disappointed with the decoration. It's way too empty. It looks like a sort. Basically, do you know what this looks like? This looks like actually something Bethesda would make. You know what I mean? It has. It's a bit too realistic. I, I need clutter. I need it slightly weird for my own little style. Maybe that's it. That little step there, by the way, is I put some invisible lights because the lighting was shit as well. Anyway, as always, follow me on Twitter at NoRespawns. I will have a new video soon. The next one will be a mod review. And the video after that will be the final castle tour. <gasps> Le gasp. Anyway, until then, prepare your anuses and have a lovely week. Take care.